I'm in the daytime kitchen with our friend, Chef John Shop. Glad to have you back. It's great to be back. Thanks for having me. I, I okay, so my first question is, do you cook for, for Thanksgiving? Um, I cook a little bit for Thanksgiving, okay. but my father and my wife, um, they kind of take over for Thanksgiving for the holidays for me, so I can rest a little bit. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. I, was, I always wonder that. So today <laughs> we're going to talk about pies. Yeah. Thanksgiving pies. I want to take this on. I'm taking on the cooking this year, You're gonna and I'm well. probably going to be a little overwhelmed, but luckily <laughs> I have people like you and our viewers who are here to offer tips. So we'll go through a couple of questions okay, great. that are pretty common like pie making questions. Great. The first is mealy versus flaky pie crust. What's the, What's the difference? difference? Um, mealy versus flaky pie crust depends on the type of pie we want to make. If we're okay. going to cook the filling in the pie, we might want to go flaky. If we're okay. going to fill the pie, like a cream pie, banana cream pie or something, we want them to go mealy. Okay. Mealy pie um, doughs are more resilient to moisture. They've, the fat is more incorporated into the flour. Okay. And the only difference is how much we break that fat up in into the flour. Oh, so okay. we can break it up a little bit and leave chunks of fat about the size of um, walnut pieces and have a flaky, almost no, like a croissant type of okay. pie crust. Or if we break it down a little bit more, then it's, it's mealy and a little more um, um, resistant to soaking in and yes. sogging out. Okay, all right, next question. <laughs> is there a difference between butter, shortening, lard, margarine? I've always wondered this yeah, when I cook. Huge difference, and, okay. and everybody talks about this whole, you know, baking is such a science, but really it's, it's a playground. So we okay. have to put fat in it. This is a simple pie, pie dough, three parts, two parts, one parts, three, two, one. So okay. the, the two parts is fat, and we can choose butter, which is the best flavor, maybe a little more difficult to work with. Okay. Shortening or lard is going to give you a lighter, crisper, flakier because it's not bringing along a water content that butter has okay. and the milk solids that butter has. Um, but we can even use things like um, goat cheese, goat ricotta, or <gasps> cream cheese, or peanut delicious. butter for some of what we use for that fat. Interesting. Yeah. Okay, so when we come back, we have more questions for Chef John here, and we'll actually, you know, put everything together put it and together. kind of That's learn. So part. don't go away, you're watching Daytime Blue Ridge.